Welcome to Latin Nation, celebrating your generation from coast to coast. I'm your host, Humberto Guida, and like many of you out there, I like horror movies. But you know what? I'm not a huge fan of reboots. Now, when the landmark horror franchise Evil Dead got its remake, my skeptic take on doing old movies was completely deconstructed. And that had a lot to do with the style and vision of the director, Fetty Alvers, who also happens to be kicking off today's show. Now, Fetty's rise up the Hollywood ranks is a story unto itself. We all hear about people who make themselves famous by posting videos on YouTube. But most of those videos are usually footage of grumpy cat bloopers or random people standing in front of a green screen ranting and raving about some pop cultural current event we won't even remember next week. But Fetty actually used YouTube to get himself noticed as a quality filmmaker with a short film that went viral. And you can hear all about it right here, right now, on Latin Nation. Brought to you by State Farm. For auto, home, life, and banking, get to a better state. We live in a time where you can post your short on YouTube or any platform you want and, and end up being discovered, quote unquote, by a producer, for sure. And it's something you, as a director, you should pursue. They were all talking about Fede is this young new director that everyone's excited about because he, he did this miraculous thing of making this, I don't know, how long is it, eight minutes? five minutes short for $300 that got everyone's attention in Hollywood. If you see an actor doing a great job on, on a YouTube short, nobody's stopped from hiring them out because the audio is YouTube and not TV. If you do something that is good and is relevant, you know, people will get to you. People like Fede Alvarez and us are able to, to make these shorts. Something effective that, uh, you know, mainstream producers, I think, can see uh, as something that has potential. New technologies allow you to do things easier. And in the case of, you know, Fede, he did like this super production in, at his, in his room, basically. In, in Montevideo, yeah. when a producer sees that something has two million hits in 10 days, you know, it starts, you know, creating an itch, so it's good. Everything started with that short, and, uh, and actually we still want to make it. I mean, that's something we're still talking about it with, with Tam, and hopefully we'll find a way to do it. And at the same time, Evil Dead was happening, and he offered me if I want to do it, and I said yes. You are all going to die tonight. I really wanted to be in a horror film, actually. Oh, you know better. I, now I know better. Now I know I'm never gonna, we're gonna do it again. There was something in the woods. We test the movie once before, you know, we put it out there. You always do that in Hollywood, right? You gather an audience that doesn't know what, what they're gonna see and you show them the movie and they loved it and it was great. And, and half of them were people that knew Evil Dead and the other half were a new audience that had no idea and, and it worked equally for both you know, groups. So that was when we felt, okay, we have something that works. And we really care about it and we really wanna make the best film we could. confident that, that we we're going to, to happily surprise them. And I think we did. We're gonna get you. Not another peep. Time to go to sleep. 